We've invited you here today to officially close the Christmas Fund campaign and make a presentation to our 2008 beneficiaries, as well as acknowledging the local partners who embraced our campaign, our reporters and photographers who brought so many heartwarming stories to light, and we also want to thank the Calgary Herald employees who every year welcome this campaign and help us in raising much needed funds. Well, thank you and good morning, everybody. Uh, welcome to the Calgary Herald. We're here, of course, to celebrate the uh, Calgary Herald 2008 Christmas Fund campaign, and I think you all have a little bit of a sense that it went pretty well. Uh, and for the past two years, the Calgary Herald Christmas Fund has enjoyed substantial fundraising success. And since its inception in 1991, the Christmas Fund has raised more than $10.5 million for local charities. This year, Calgarians have once again demonstrated that they are here to help those who have not received the benefits of our city's good fortune. This Christmas, our loyal Calgary Herald readers and Calgary citizens pushed the total beyond our campaign goal, which we felt was, I think you'd all agree, pretty ambitious given the current tech. And I'll make it out there. We were celebrating our 125th anniversary in 2008, and we thought it would be fitting to set $1.25 million as our fundraising goal for the campaign. Through the campaign, we heighten awareness of the many challenges faced by thousands of Calgarians and highlight the tremendous work performed in our community by people like you, the agencies represented here today. On any given night in Calgary, at least 203 children aged 12 and under will be homeless. In the past year, foot care has been given to approximately 1,200 individuals by the Wellness on Wheels Community Health Fest. And every night, approximately 114 men need beds at the Calgary Dream Center. And Calgary has the second highest rate of domestic violence in Canada. Over the course of five weeks, the Christmas Fund shed light, uh, shed light on difficult situations like the ones I just mentioned by informing readers about the various social issues in our community, including hunger, homelessness, addiction, abuse, and violence. Far from being tales of despair, the series of features, guest columns, and photographs illustrated hope, compassion, and optimism. The money raised from this year's fund will, without a doubt, be put to fantastic use, helping to alleviate some of the pressures faced by both the selected agencies and the clients that they serve. I am so thrilled that uh, our campaign met the goal and we we're able to tell the stories of everyday people uh, who are helped by fellow Calgarians and thank them for their generosity. Thanks uh, to the good, new, good deeds of the numerous charities in this room today, um, a lot of people who may be down on their luck in our city are seeing some brightness among the clouds. That's why I'm very pleased to announce today that the 2008 Christmas Fund has raised $1,312,833.00. Wow.